Hello. Today we're going to show a little bit on how to install a Prodigy motor. Uh, first of all, I'd like to remind everybody, please unplug your machine whenever you're working around anything with voltage. Um, make sure it's unplugged and that it's safe. Make sure that this times out to where the little LED light is not lit and, and then wait a little longer. Okay, with that said, I've already removed the cover taken off the back cover. There's a screw in the front and a screw at the bottom that will take that off. Um, another note I want to make is when connecting the motor, I've, I've actually ran the wire down on this motor and I've connected it up to the amplifier. The black wire goes to the number two positive on the amplifier. The red wire will go to the number one negative. Okay, and what you're going to need to do is take your belt and put it on the pulley before you get it tightened up. And then we're going to want to put the screws in the motor. Line up the hole. And I already had the pulley on this motor. If you have to, there are two set screws that will screw this pulley on this to put it on there. Okay. Now, one thing I want to note, to adjust the motor, you don't need a, a large pry bar or anything. You just want to lift it. Make sure you got a little tension on it. And I'm just going to tighten a couple of screws right now. And we, we're going to also have to check, because we replaced the motor, our needle up and our needle down will not be set correctly. So, I'm now plugged in the machine. And I'm going to turn it on. And I'm going to run it quick and turn it off. <clears throat> okay. Now... I'm going to check and see where my needle is, and I want my needle up. So I see that find the needle up, I'm going to take a pencil, and I'm going to mark that. Okay, and now, when I run this, it's stopping. just going to make a mark here and a mark down here and you can line those up for your needle up and your needle down. If you need to change the position of where your needle is, you're going to come back, you're going to loosen this and you're going to get this to move while you're holding the blower one with your needle up, and you're going to place your mark up. You're going to come back, lift your motor. I'm just going to tighten a couple of these. Okay, now I've got needle up needle down. That's all I want. That's the only adjustment you have to do. You're going to take mark your pulleys for where you want it and where your motor stops up or down you're either going to be needle up or needle down. If you get this backwards and it's opposite of your setting you're just going to do what I did lower your motor back down hold the pulley and turn it halfway around again and then you're going to be set on the correct needle up or needle down whichever way you prefer. 
Okay, I hope this helps you and have a very good day.